hello you guys welcome back to another vlog of mine today i really wanted to just pick up the camera and film a realistic week in my life just kind of my day-to-day -day itineraries for the week today i decided to wash my hair it felt so dry so i tried out this new technique on tiktok called hair not hair it's called oil pulling and i saturated my hair with oil like my scalp my ends i left it on for like about 30 to an hour but it says you could leave it on up to like two hours something like that so i tried it out and so far i feel like my hair feels so soft i need to continue doing that because ever since i started bleaching it my hair has gotten so stiff and straw like and i hate it so much because for years i didn't diet i didn't bleach it i let my natural dark hair grow out and it felt so healthy and soft and ever since i started bleaching it it has gotten very rough i mean i love the bleached look on me like the balayage but it's very hard to maintain and it does take a toll on your hair so i'm gonna start um doing the hair pulling the hair pulling why do i keep saying that i'm gonna start doing the oil pulling once a week and let you guys know how that's working out for me um but yeah right now i just got myself put together threw on a t-shirt and threw a little bit of penitent just to look a little bit more presentable um but yeah i'm gonna start actually folding i want to show you guys these new sheets i just got from amazon they're like these waffle this waffle material i just washed it threw it in the dryer and it's so nice and fluffy i'm super excited to have white sheets again i just can't let my dogs near my room because they will destroy the white sheets so we'll see how that goes white sheets are kind of like dangerous but we'll see i'll let you guys know also link them down below because i really do like them they're so nice and fluffy yeah also my lamps have not arrived i think they're gonna come tomorrow so i'll show you guys when they arrive but yeah i'm gonna fold some laundry first also here are my sheets just so you guys can get a close-up look they're so soft and really affordable off amazon so i'll link them but they came with two pillowcases and then the um, duvet cover so you do need to have a comforter to put this um, on top of but i really like how it looks i think it's going to be a nice winter vibe <music> anybody is wondering this is my planner i have been using for the past few months it's by the tiktok creator kaylee may she did a collab with still and i feel like this is my favorite planner i've ever had it has like all these refills um like page refills you can use it has compartments and it's like a little binder section and it also has these really cool pages that you can like put your rituals routines write this down you also could um, use this to budget quarterly annually that's just some like wedding venue goes looking at a random or like your weekly planner looks let's say it's monday you can write down your to-do list right here you also have these boxes so i kind of put like my big event for the day in this and then my to-dos in these lines <music> So I stepped out of the house really quick. I had to go return the Christmas plaid PJs. I had bought the matching ones for my fiance and I because they didn't fit. And if I keep lagging, I'm not gonna be able to order some like set that I want. So I went to return those to Petco. I kind of looked around to see if there was any cute stuff for Olive and Pepper. I did see cute Christmas PJs, but I'm holding off on those because I did already buy them like some bandanas to match with us. So I'll see if you know that matches well with the ones i'm gonna order i saw another cute pair off amazon that i'm thinking of getting if not i'm just gonna give up and get them off target but yeah i'm just gonna head to movina now and get myself a smoothie and then from there probably pick up dinner for my fiance and i he wants me to stop by and get us some pupusas so i'm gonna go ahead and go do that 
Okay, so I just got an Amazon package and it's nothing special, but I wanted to share in case some of you guys have dogs or pets. So I normally don't order Olive and Pepper's dog food from Amazon, but this time I really wanted to try it out because every time I go to Target, I feel like it's such limited options and I don't really like to give them or get them like cheap food. I really do like to invest in their um, kibble. So I saw that this was rated highly on TikTok, like some girl was talking about it. And then I went on Amazon and had a lot of reviews. So this is by the brand Wellness. And this is in a deboned chicken and oatmeal recipe. That sounded like something really good for olives, especially. And it says it's supposed to be good for skin and coat, energy and immunity. We kind of try to focus a lot on the protein percentage because chow chows do have to be very careful when it comes to what type of or how much protein they intake compared to like border collies. So that's as far as I know. I'm not like an expert on dog food. If you guys have any suggestions, let me know in the comments. Also, nothing too expensive because I know a lot of brands, brands that are really good are just way too out of price reach is that the correct terminology but it's just way too expensive when you have two dogs to get like the top top brand but i still want to buy something that is like good for them you know so i'm trying this out let me know what you guys think about it and then i've always heard heard really good things about purina one which is the dog brand dog food brand that we buy them but i wanted to try out the wet food just to mix it in i'm probably going to be using like half for olive half for pepper so i think this will kind of last me a little while hopefully they love fresh wet food so i think they'll like this so got this one in i think the chicken flavor yeah got this in the chicken flavor and then just ordered one of these while i was at it i love this this is the best to clean everything in your house but anyway just wanted to share that with you guys in case you know you guys were interested in dog content because i would be more than happy to get sponsored by dog brands <laughs> but anyway i just want to share that with you guys you guys good morning it's obviously the next day and it is monday over here so we had to start off strong with some coffee to wake us up and have a very good day i actually ordered this so this so this super cute saucer mug from amazon amazon oh my, God, my accent's coming out <laughs> from amazon it's so freaking cute it's kind of like funny like it's not your average mug but i feel like it's so cute and i love to like have aesthetic pictures and videos for you guys so i feel like this is perfect for that i don't know i'm like obsessed with it it's so cute and chubby but yeah and it comes with this little saucer i'll have it linked for you guys but actually let's try this out first because i need some coffee i just did a regular coffee today using my sweet cream instant or natural bliss creamer this is like my top top favorite creamer i always repurchase this if you guys like the starbucks um cold foam the vanilla cold foam this tastes just like it probably throw in some heavy whipping cream and you got yourselves the exact same thing so we're doing holiday drinks at home this year but anyway guys let's try this out it's so good i literally love coffee so much but anyway i don't know if i love coffee or just love the taste of sugar in the morning but anyway um we have a very busy day today I have work right now. I have to get myself put together. I have like kind of a to-do list for myself today. I'm also very exciting. I'm filming this little campaign for Il Maquillage with their new skincare product that they just came out with. So I have to do that today um, along with work and household things. So it's kind of a very busy day. The Il Maquillage product I am filming a campaign for for them is actually a new moisturizer they just came out with that I actually love. So I'll use it with you guys probably at night with like 
for like my skincare night routine. I'll probably be filming that at some point during my lunch. So oh, that's the plan for today. Let's get ourselves set up for work. I'm gonna change, get logged in, and then I'll probably check back in with you guys when I make breakfast. I'm thinking of having oatmeal today, so keeping it nice and easy. Unfortunately, it is lunchtime. I skipped breakfast. I'm telling you guys, I'm just like not a breakfast girly. I wish I was. I love like avocado toast and maybe like a hard boiled egg or like something like that or like oatmeal. But otherwise, I just like really just don't care for it. I'd rather just wait for lunch and have myself a little bit of a filler meal for the day. That's just me. So it's lunchtime right now. I have been working away. Um, I also had some time right now to film that quick moisturizer campaign I told you guys about. So I got that done and I have some time left to either cook something or reheat. I'm kind of thinking of just reheating. I have leftovers from last night's dinner. So I think I'm just gonna eat that and throw on a Gossip Girl for my little lunch break because honestly, it just takes too much time sometimes to cook something and that just takes away from the time where I can just like relax and unwind and have my Dr. Pepper. So I just kind of want to do that. I am literally on a Dr. Pepper kick my whole life. Never liked Dr. Pepper, don't like it. I was just always a Coke girly. I was gonna say Coke Zero because I love my Coke Zero now, but Dr. Pepper, zero sugar whatever it's called is my new kick right now so i'm also waiting for my lamps to arrive they should get here any second now i'm so excited i think only one out of the two is arriving which is so weird i thought they would like send them in like a package together but i got an alert from target saying um like the carrier left a note for me saying we have to wait to send this to you because we were told to hold off or something like that I'm like that is so weird so i'm only gonna get one of the lamps today who knows when i'll get the second one and then my christmas sheets are coming this week too so it's all coming together very exciting stuff <laughs> just about four o'clock and i got done with work i <laughs> olive um i wanted to get out of the house because i haven't obviously left all day i just went outside to take olive and pepper out to like play in the yard but that was pretty much it i really want to go ahead and get my steps in and get some vitamin d before the sun goes down as you guys know the sun sets by like 5 p.m which gives us so little time throughout the day to do anything like I love it because it gives me an excuse to be cozy, but I also am like, damn, there's not enough hours in the day. So I'm just going to go ahead and get the girls ready and then head out for a nice little stroll. I also want to make time to read today. I haven't picked up a new book in a while ever since I finished um, Things We Never Got Over. So I think we're going to start one today and get into that. smells so good and it looks so colorful i added some broccoli onion carrots mushrooms um and chicken sausage and i'm gonna put this over some white rice and this just sounds so good and it's pretty healthy we kind of just got rid of everything we had in the fridge this was like all the veggies i had so it kind of worked out
shower and I'm about to do my nighttime skin routine. Well, kind of. I'm just going to use very simple products tonight, but I wanted to show you guys the plumping anti-aging cream I received by Il Maquillage. This is how the packaging looks. It's like, actually really heavy and feels very fancy. And it's supposed to be a 3-in-1 cream that's a serum, moisturizer, and a primer before makeup, which is actually really cool. And the inside, like the actual moisturizer, smells so good. The consistency actually reminds me a lot of the Neutrogena Hydro Gel Cream. But yeah, I've been trying it out and I actually really like it. But first, I'm going to go in with my Merit Glow um, Instant Glow Serum. Really love this one. They also sent this to me and I would repurchase this because it gives you like an instant boost of hydration to the skin. Like you guys can already tell. I really like it. And it feels really light. How the skin is looking with just the serum. So I'm going to lock it all in now using this. I actually have another cream that was gifted to me. This, I'm not even sure where you can find this, but it's a lifting and firming neck cream. So I've been using it for my neck. And it comes with this like drunk elephant looking pump, which I like a lot. It's like fun to dispense it. And it feels very fancy. I'm not even sure what the pricing is for this, but I like it. If I can find it on Amazon, I'll like link it for you. myself ready for the day and i need to head out before the sun goes down i only get a couple of hours before it turns like really dark out but i wanted to show you guys really quick this lighting like this is amazing i'm using the like really popular alex earl like portable light and it's so freaking good like look at how bright that is you can even change like the type of lighting you guys want like if you want it more yellow more white but I've been doing my makeup with it on, even if there's daylight. It just like helps me like see everything and it's so good. Like if you guys want really good pictures or, you know, to take it for your travel vlogs or travel pictures, whatever it is you guys are recording, it's really good lighting. So I'll link it for you guys because I feel like everybody needs this light if you guys like taking selfies or taking videos on the go at night. It's just so good. Also have to make a quick stop at Best Buy to pick up this new little camera I bought. And then also maybe Sephora. I'm still iffy I'm gonna, if I'm gonna stop by or if I should just like <laughs> not spend. Um, but also my lamps just arrived from Target. As you guys know, I've been waiting for so long for them to come. And one of them finally came. The other one is maybe gonna arrive tomorrow i don't even know the thing has been lagging and the bed sheets also got postponed more days so we'll see when that comes but i'm really hoping that the lamps arrive all in one piece because lately all my packages have been arriving messed up but anyway let's go get the lamp sunbox the lamp cooking. it arrived in one piece Oh my god, they are so pretty. I'm actually so excited. This is stunning. Okay, I took everything off my nightstand so we can... Ah, I love it so much. It's so cute. So these are actually... So these are actually a collaboration that Target did with Studio McGee. If you guys can you see it. It's like they're really like aesthetic collections that they normally come out with. Okay, I have to say these were definitely worth the wait. These are so pretty. They look very expensive and they honestly weren't. And they're a really good size. Like they're not tiny. This is actually really perfect as a bedside lamp. I'm so obsessed with it. I have to put a light 
a light. <laughs> I have to put a lamp in it to light it up still, but I'm seriously so obsessed. I feel like they're so cute.